Here with uh, Billy Walsh. Uh, today, 300 par. Yesterday, 500 par. So you're now eight total, Billy. Um, you may have thought when you first teed off it was going to be a, a long way to catch Brim, but here you are, pretty close. Yeah, you know, I I wasn't trying to go out there and catch him. I just wanted to put a solid round together, hit fairways, hit greens, and um, hopefully make up a little bit of ground. He played really well today. He just didn't make any putts, so um, it'll be fun tomorrow. I mean, it seems like he and I have been going back and forth for the last couple of years, so. Maybe it's my turn to, to come out on top, but uh, I've got a long way to go. We'll see what happens. Obviously, you're a great player. That's uh, that's no uh, that's no uh, debate. But um, it seems like every time we have an event, you're you're right there on the hunt. You always seem to peak. Uh, how do you do it? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I you know what? I work hard at my game. Um, I've always been a good ball striker. Um, my putting's gotten better, more consistent this year. And I mean, this week I put the new TaylorMade SLDR in the bag, and it's. I mean, I'm 10 yards longer, and I'm hitting it a lot straighter. So it's it's given me a lot of confidence off the tee to just pick a line and hit it as hard as I can and, and go at it. So yeah, you should be in the final group. Well, we don't know until Reggie and other guys finish off. But uh, are you a guy who wants to be in that final group to wait so you can kind of see what's going on? You're not, not really guessing with the leaderboards and the whole deal. Yeah, I'm always I always want to know what's going on, yeah. and it does. It affects the way you play, especially the way you guys set up the golf course today. It's going to affect how you approach certain shots, um, lines off the tee, shots into the greens, and even putting. Right, how aggressive you want to be. So. Yeah, I always like being in the heat and being in the hunt. Final question for you. You've won almost everything you need to win in Ontario, but what you're missing right now is probably one of our national ones. Uh, how cool would that be? Oh, it would be awesome. It'd be, it was funny because they announced Bryn today and they announced Mike, and they're both two-time champions, and I laughed to Mike. I'm like, you guys are getting too greedy. I just want to win one of them. So, um, yeah, we'll see what happens. We've got a lot of golf to play tomorrow, and, uh, you know, just get off to a good start, keep it in the fairway, keep it in the green, and hopefully the putter's hot. And, We'll see what happens. Awesome, man. Well, uh, great playing, and we'll see you tomorrow on likely the final group. Awesome. Thanks, Jeff.